With the increased population comes the need for power, comes the need for metals, comes the need for all kinds of lithium, for, for batteries in cars. All of these products produce waste. Cold Fusion Concrete uses all of these wastes in the concrete. Not only are the products that we produce of elevated quality as compared to Portland cement concrete, but they use all these industrial wastes. So a really good uh, example is red mud, which is the residue from the Bayer process of extracting alumina from bauxite. There are billions of tons of red mud spread throughout the world. In big impoundments, there's no resolution as to its use. So all this property, these tens of thousands of acres are condemned unless it's used. If you were to look on Cougar Earth today and you were to see large red spots, that's red mud, okay? And, and it's, really, it's really easy to notice. Say if it's around the rivers or the oceans, if a hurricane comes and hits that plant, don't you think it's gonna carry some of that red mud with it? And it's gonna lead into the ocean. So now, not only do we have an issue with our drinking waters, hey, we also have an issue now with the aquatic life. Red mud is beneficial in our technology. It, uh, it doesn't reduce the strength, it doesn't reduce the longevity, it actually enhances the technical characteristics of our material. So we use waste from all kinds of products. People drive electric cars and think they're being very, very green, but they don't see the waste involved or created from lithium. We use that waste in the process of producing concrete and the examples of the waste that we use are endless.